Welcome to PicPayProject.com The title of our project is An Ontology Based Text Mining Method to Cluster Proposal for Research Project Selection Now let's see the abstract of this paper Research Project Selection is an important task for all type of research funding agencies When a large number of research proposals are received It is difficult to group them according to their similarity and their discipline areas it will consume more time to classify according to their similarity. The major problem we found in HST system is we cannot resolve the problem by classifying text document automatically. And also in existing method, we have limitation when dealing non-English language text like Chinese research proposal. We cannot resolve a very complex optimization problem. In this paper, we proposed a method called ontology based text mining method. It can solve the problem by classifying text document automatically. For that, we are using clustering concept. It is an efficient and effective method for classifying and clustering the research proposal. In proposed system, we are using genetic algorithm for optimization problem which can be used to solve very complex and optimization problem. The result of our proposed system is effective and efficient of research proposal selection process in government agencies and also private agencies. Now let's see the system architecture of this project. In first place we are selecting data set which contains old data proposals. After that we are applying this data set into research ontology in which we are classifying the research, research proposals according to the year and according to the discipline areas. If in case of any submitting the new proposals, we are submitting this proposal in third phase, that is submitted proposals. After submission, we are classifying the submitted proposal in classified proposals. Then we are grouping the research proposals according to their similarity and according to their discipline areas. If in case of group is large, we are applying the clustering process that means balance and regroup process after that again we are checking that if group is large or not if it is large means then the cluster process is continued if it is not the process is assigned to the reviewers now let's see the brief project in explanation open microsoft visual studio and run the project browse the data set in my case ontology data set with application choose the data set and Extract and store it in database and view the extracted file and go to research ontology and click discipline areas and research areas. It will show how many discipline areas are and how many research areas are available in our data set. After that, find ontology, then update ontology. If in case of submitting any new proposal, we can update our ontology here. If, for example, if we are submitting one file cloud computing to security then choose the file that means pdf file and enter the here then affiliate needs to update we can update any number of proposals here go back and research topic in which in which year what are the discipline areas are available in this discipline area in 2030 how many papers are available we can show the whole data here in 2010 there are three discipline areas are available choose artificial intelligence and click view there is only one person available then flow to classification find discipline areas and show it and also find the search area and show it and find the classification and view the proposals in these proposals are going to enter into the balance and regroup phase and go to text mining browse the pdf file in this phase we are going to submitting new pdf file 
that we are going to classify according to their similarities and click view the pdf files are converting into text file here and remove the stop words and remove special characters and organize features in which each and every word considers as a features then find less repeated words that means less important words now delete less repeated words and go to df idf df idf means term frequency and inverse document frequency which is used to find each and every word weight from that only we have to find that what are the words are important what are the words are uh, less important words after finding df idf the message pop like process successfully completed then click ok it will link it to next page in next page we are going to choose a subset from the original set find the minimum idf value why we are choosing minimum df idf value means we are going to delete that less important words that means less weighted words subset has been chosen the subset now contains 755 words if we again want to choose any subset means click minimum df idf and choose the vector database section it will contain 439 words contain 291 words it is enough to submit it to the reviewer and click here in cluster text we are going to classify the proposal that means submit a proposal into research areas from this important words we are going to classify the paper okay this important words should contain any keywords according to the discipline areas if data many means the data words should be repeated then we can use the dictionary data set in which we can choose any word now to retrieve the relevant meaning for that particular word and also we can add any words to the dictionary we'll go to back button and uh, in this view class of proposals it will show the choose the research area and view it will show the what are the papers are available in particular domain then go button then balance and regroups in balance and regroups we have to choose one in which domain we are going to balance and regroup that means cluster it will show the best group and also regroup proposal if uh, these best proposal are submitted to reviewer and re in this regrouping proposal are again comes to the cluster process then analysis go to find as much as choose the data to search to search term and click search button and it will trigger the retrieve document and user have to enter the number of relevant documents according to their search query if 15 documents are relevant to the search query means enter 15 and click find f motion button f motion value then it will show the what you method that means existing proposed system is a existing system it will show the deviation in percentage go to analysis in analysis frequency of keyword it will show the how many papers are available in artificial intelligence cryptography and like that after that f measure value then comparison of existing and proposed system that means otm and tm thank you